Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetechforteachers.com. In this video, we're going to take a look at using the Google Sheets add-on called Online Rubric. I wrote about this on the blog yesterday, and I've already gotten a bunch of questions about it. So I'm just, give, just going to give you a short walkthrough of the process here. So let's start out by installing the add-on. If you haven't already done so, you can go to Get Add-ons then up here do a search for online rubric and there it is and if you don't have it installed you'll see an install button instead of a manage button so give it permission to run and now we'll go into the menu we'll say build roster and we'll give this a name we'll just call it a sample roster And the nice thing about this add-on is that it does give you very specific directions on how to set up your roster. So let's go over here and fill in a name here. And we'll do one more. So now I have my roster set up, must verify that. And the reason for the email field is so that you can email grades to students later. And let's create a new rubric here. And you'll notice down at the bottom of the screen, there'll be a new sheet that is created called rubric template. And again, you get very specific directions on how to fill out the spreadsheet to create the rubric. So with step one, we'll start in cell B1, and we'll give a score value. So let's call this five, four, three, two, and one. Uh, now over here, we're gonna start with cell A2 and name some categories. So let's do spelling, grammar, punctuation. And now we can fill in the descriptors here. I'll just make this quick and say perfect. Let's say very good. over here we'll just do good and we'll say needs improvement and then we'll say needs significant improvement Now, obviously, if I was building this as a roster that I would, a rubric that I would use in the classroom, I'd have a lot more in each one of those cells. But for the sake of demonstration, we'll just leave it at that. And now let's submit that rubric. And this sets up our email template. You don't really need to pay a whole lot of attention to this. Uh, you can simply run it you don't need to mod you can modify it if you want to but you don't need to modify it that's a new sheet within the roster spreadsheet here a rubric spreadsheet there's our rubric template and now we have a score sheet over here so let's go ahead and give out some points uh, let's say that max got five points for spelling four for grammar and three for punctuation Morrison got one for spelling three for grammar Four for punctuation gives us totals if you want to use a multiplier you can we can say send email yes or no let's go ahead and send the emails and we'll say send email 
and now the emails have been sent with the grades and the scores in each category along with that email goes the description that's in each part of the rubric as well so that's a quick overview of creating an online rubric in Google Spreadsheets. And for more tips and tricks like this, check out freetechforteachers.com.